Welcome, witches, wise ones, and wanderers. We are going to throw the bones for this week upcoming. Today is July 10th. And this is the point in the ritual where we figure out what the more I have to say about the week upcoming. So let's open things up. Take out our dice. See what has coming our way in this week upcoming. Great and mighty Morai, help guide these dice and show us next week. All right, we've got two out and an almost out. With our out here, we've got our two. That one is south fire, so our will is out. Four on the d20. Well, there is no surprise, good surprise, or friend coming. That's okay. Tree frog, take big risks. He's almost out. Don't know if that's good or bad yet. We've got the sun, we've got time. We've got Yang. Our moon is six, which is a waning give us harvest. And we've got our sea turtle. We're pull back, look within, and take, take things slow and steady. Okay, we've got time. We've got time. We've got the sun for growth, so we've got time to grow. We need to pull back, work on our harvest. Yang, we need to be active. We've got time to do this. It's not time to take a big risk yet. It's not time to jump out. Don't expect anything good. No good surprises this week. And we're feeling a bit out with our action and our passion. Yeah, I can see that. Let's get, what can we do to get this back in? What can we do to get our passion back in? Let's use the steampunk tarot. Get our passion back in. And what can we do to get our passion back in? Oh, the reverse tower. Okay. To get our passion back in, we need to avoid disaster. disaster. Wow. That's usually easier said than done. Hmm. I love this tower card. But definitely do prefer seeing it like this in reverse. So to get our passion back, we need to feel as if we've avoided disaster. When should we take this big leap? Almost out. If it's almost time, when should we take this big leap? 
When should we take this big leap? Oh, too many. When should we take this big leap? Three of swords in reverse. My mind fails me on that beauty. We should take this big leap after recovery, forgiveness, and moving on. That makes sense. This week we need to work on avoiding disasters, take our time and recover before we move on. We've got time. Things are growing. Just need to be slow and steady and work on this harvest. Be active with it. Well, that's a beautiful reading for this week. Shame there are no good surprises coming our way, but not every week can be lottery ticket winners, right? Well, thank you, witches, wise ones, and wanderers for stopping in. I hope the dice fall in your favor this week, too. <laughs>